Mark 5, from 25. Quickly, quickly. Mark 5, 25. Because they told Jesus, I like that scripture. Right? Ah, they told Jesus, they just couldn't say it. Jesus. Yeah. 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 Was but not rather, better, yeah? Continue. But rather grew worse. When she had heard of Jesus came in the press behind and touched his garment. For she said, if I may touch but his clothes, I shall be made whole. Yeah. Continue. And straight away, the fountain of her blood was dry up. Okay. And she felt in her, her body that she was healed. Okay. And purged. Continue. Verse 30. And Jesus immediately knew himself that virtue had gone out of him something and he turned up in impressed and said who touched my clothes and continue verse 31 and his disciples said unto him those seated multitude surrounding thee and saying that who touched me verse 32 and he looked around about to see her that had done this thing praise the lord you know the disciples said <laughs> jesus <laughs> the good one said to pull again I said, I said, if I was there, I said, oh, wait. <laughs> behind you, I said, <laughs> who touch you? Say, ah, Master, look at this place. No, just say, no, 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 no. Say, no, no. I said, faith touched me. That's what Jesus was saying. You know, you know, you, that's, it's the same thing happens in church. Different people come to church. Same message, nothing happens. Same message, nothing will happen. You know why? No faith. Can't happen. So you're not entertained. A lot of people came there to say, "Let's that guy that is doing miracles. You can see him. Yeah, that's the miracle guy. Yeah. <laughs> Solid guy. It's not even fine. Yeah. <laughs> I'm telling you, people came there. The same way people come to church today. Come and check what the pastor is wearing. Or come and, ah, some people just came there to say, that guy, when the, anywhere he goes, a lot of crowd, we can sell some things. Let me just go and sell, take my wares and sell some water to pray water. I mean, that's what happens in church. Some people come to church just to sell. I'm telling you. As you're preaching, they don't even give it down. That waiting for service to end so they can start selling. But I brought some clothes to so come and see. That's what they came to in church. So, different people, so some people were touching Jesus. Hey, I thought the guy said, It's a great guy. Nothing happened to Jesus. That's not faith. But when that woman said, If only I can touch this guy, I'll be whole. So when she touched Jesus, something came. I just said, mm. Who touched me? Say, so, ah. So, ah. He said, Master, I said, no, 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 no. I said, faith touched me. Who touched me? He said, I did. He said, yeah, I know. He said, your faith has made you whole. Because I can't ignore faith. I cannot ignore faith. God cannot ignore faith. It's not possible. God cannot ignore faith. God cannot. Can ignore your money. Can ignore your cries. Can ignore faith. 